Edit trick for everyone. In DaVinci Resolve, click the small circle on the media in node to display it in the left viewer window. Make the left viewer larger since most of our work will happen there. Now add a merge node between the media in and media out nodes. Press Ctrl plus Shift plus Spacebar, search for chroma key and add it. Connect the media in node to the chroma key node like this. Select the chroma key node, and on the right side in the inspector, check lock color picking. Now open the color range section. Here, adjust the red color amount until only the red areas remain visible in the viewer and everything else fades out. Then go to the matte tab and check invert matte. Go back to the chroma tab and slightly increase the soft range just a bit. Now add a color corrector node. Click its small circle to show it in the left viewer window. In the inspector, reduce saturation to zero. And you'll see your entire image turn black and white. Now connect the color corrector node to the merge node. Enlarge the right viewer window. You'll notice that only the red dress remains in color while everything else is black and white. That's our color splash effect. Now go back to the edit page. Enable the top V2 clip, toggle it on and off to see the difference. And that's it, full tutorials waiting for you, link in description.